My name is Michael Pepe. I am a producer, mixer, and songwriter based here in Los Angeles, California. We are currently in North Hollywood at my studio inside of Fab Factory. Some artists I've worked with that you might have heard about are Taking Back Sunday, Little Lotus, The Hire, Cassidy Pope, and Huddy. My biggest tool in the studio are my Trio 6s. With the detail I'm able to get out of them, I'm able to make the decisions as a producer, mixer, songwriter that need to be made. Being able to say that's where the harmonies are and the vocal is in a good spot, or like all those things matter. Like what I'm hearing is number one and I've chosen very confidently to do that through the vocals. When I started getting the inquiry of, hey, we want an Atmos mix for this. It's like, okay, well I don't have Adobe Atmos Studio so that there's a problem. And this was actually like on a record that was like, I was already producing and mixing and the A&R was like, hey, we need Atmos mixes. And this was like, cool, well, we need those in two weeks. Uh, I can't set up a Domi Atmos Studio in two weeks. Even if I wanted to, that wasn't gonna happen. So I was in a unique position where I had to get this done. They have this thing, which is imperative, called binaural mixing mode. You can strap on any pair of headphones, ideally open back to mock a monitor situation, and you can hear things magically in Dolby Atmos. With any pair of headphones, you can just put on your pair of headphones and be listening in Dolby Atmos, which means you have a complete 720 experience with a pair of stereo headphones, which is amazing. I can do this in binaural mode and I can do it pretty well. I want to be able to have an, an, a really accurate representation of what's happening in headphones for people, but at the same time, I want to be able to hear my Focals, but on my head. The ClearMG Pros are the closest thing I've ever heard to Focals speakers in a headphone form. When I put those on, it's like a really good representation of not only what's happening in the stereo field for a listener, but also as a producer and mixer, what's happening in the sonic field, and trusting that it's the Focal sound that I'm used to hearing on my monitors. I mix the stereo version on my trios, then I print stems, throw them into Adobe Atmos session, put on my ClearMG Pros, go into binaural mode, mix it in Atmos, and send it out. Going to the point of mixing Atmos for headphones, as opposed to for mixes like out in the world, because right now, um, those options are few and far in between. I mean, we're talking about movie theaters basically, essentially, or maybe at current, some very nice home theater systems, like or, or home listening systems, 90% of people are wearing things in their ears now, right? I find myself mixing for headphones more often than anything nowadays anyway. So the fact that that's where Atmos is really living is kind of just fine because most people listen there to begin with.